on the 5th of April and on the 8th of December 2024 respectively, the man of God Apostle Slick X Moses predicted the future through the lead of the Holy Spirit. He says he sees a flood that will wipe out some countries around the world. Under the unction of the Holy Spirit, he released this prophetic message. These were his words. This, this worry wind. Where you see a worry wind will start going from one country to another country. That is not a wind. That is an angel. As I'm talking to you, there's an angel. I will call his name. His name is Adonai Nathaniel. He's an archangel. His work is to destroy the cities of the devils. And that is the first set of the place before it starts getting to human beings. Watch this. This blood of Jesus will bear me witness over this last prophecy I want to give. It's not something that you say, you know, here I am, you know, see I am. The sound of it and the presence of it. Hmm. Wind and fire. Wind and what? It's not that fire will just come and burn. It, I don't know what will trigger a strange wind that will carry fire and begin to burn houses. And but how the most of the fire came, I say I saw electric wire. As the wind strike on them, there was lightning that strike the light. You know, fire would come out. And it will lighten something, like the way you, you strike matches. You do pop. But it never lights. So those kind of striking I saw. You see some wire will light will land on the zinc. It will bow. Not ordinary wind. When the human being will stand like this, the wind will carry the human being. But it will not take like 30 minutes, 40 minutes, it will start raining. When it starts raining, it will start causing flood. It is not like your rain you have ever witnessed on earth. But yet, it's not even rapture. I pray. That you and your family will not be a victim. Come on, hold on, hold on. You have seen it? Huh? Eh? You have seen it? Huh? Eh? I saw it. It was not rapture. You saw it? Yes, I saw it. Even the one you talk about, Abba. Yes, it's true. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. Are you hearing that? Yes, sir. I saw it. Are you hearing that? I saw it, yes. It confirmed. The word of his servant and perfect the counsel of his messenger. I stand for you and for your family and for myself. At this particular date and time, you will escape every arrow. The blood of Jesus bear me witness today. I have spoken, I have commanded. When the Lord asks you to run away from, the Lord will help you to escape. In the name of Jesus! Prophecy has not come to pass as Dubai and Saudi Arabia faces diverse natural disaster. Surely, God's word does not return to invite. Let's take a look. Dubai has been hit by a once-in-a-generation superstorm. Nearly two years' worth of rain has fallen in a single day, causing chaos on the road and on the runway. Splash down at Dubai International Airport, an Airbus looking more like a seaplane. The city, known for its arid desert conditions, caught off guard by the unexpected deluge, washing out shopping malls and the metro. Howling winds ripping furniture from balconies and forcing crowds to run for cover. It was chaos on the highways. This land cruiser is submerged. The people were pulled out from the sunroof. Roads collapsing. 
treading water, one of the only ways out. As the storm rolled in, the sky turned an ominous shade of green, 160 millimetres falling in just 24 hours, double what the city normally receives in an entire year. Abu Dhabi to the south also swamped. Shops in Sharjah to the north smashed by waves as drivers tried to escape. Who would have thought you'd ever need a boat in the desert? Sophie Walsh, Nine News. This, this worry wind, where you see a worry wind will start going from one country to another country, that is not a wind, that is an angel. As I'm talking to you, there's an angel, I'll call his name. His name is Adonai Nathaniel. He's an archangel, his work is to destroy the cities of the devils. And that is the first set of the place before it starts getting to human being. As the wind strike on them, there was lightning that strike the light. You know, fire would come out. And it will lighten something. Like the way you, you strike matches. It do up. But it never lights. So those kind of striking I saw. Not ordinary wind. Wind that human being will stand like this. The wind will carry the human being. But it will not take like 30 minutes, 40 minutes, it will start raining. When it starts raining, it will start causing flood. It is not like your rain you have ever witnessed on earth. But yet, it's not even rapture. <laughs>